Hello and what is happening? Uh, today, I'm just going to go over um, simple, quick uh, cooking instructions. Sorry. Uh, quick cooking instructions on how to oven bake some really good chicken. Uh, very simple. I've already seasoned one side. Um, the one thing I didn't show in the video is um, when you get chicken like this, any type of chicken really, um, you could put it inside a gallon sized bag. I would invest in gallon sized, ba uh, gallon -sized bags um, because you could put the chicken inside the bag and then what I like to do um, is kind of let some olive oil marinate the bag real quick. Just, you know, whatever type of olive oil you want. It doesn't have to be extra virgin and whatever you want. Um, you can also, after you coat it with some olive oil, um, sorry, my kids are staring at me like, what the heck is he doing? Um, you can also get breadcrumbs, any type of panko crust breadcrumbs or Italian style. You can do that as well. Those are options. Um, and then what I like to do is I just take it out of the bag, pop it down on a tray like this and spread my seasonings on it. Um, I haven't done the other side yet. I'm going to actually let my daughter hold the phone here so she can videotape or film. Come over here. Okay. A little bit careful that it's on a cord so you can't really go that far. Kind of get the Why side of it. That's fine. He, she can see it. You can see the chicken, right? Yeah. Okay, you can see my hands? Yeah. Okay, cool. All right, so um, we're just going to go with it. We, did, we went with a little bit of uh, Montreal chicken. Uh, seasoning here, which is some good stuff. I used another seasoning, um, which is more of a spicy one. It's not that spicy, but I used it already on one side. Now I'm going to flip it. We flip the chicken like so. Pretty simple, pretty standard. I'm sure a lot of you are like, yeah, I know how to cook, cook, uh, cook a chicken, heavy dearth. Um, but uh, that's how we're going to do it real quick. Um, Mars, can you raise it up a little bit higher? Yeah. Like that, there you go. Okay, uh, now we're going to sprinkle some on this side. Some of you are probably going to be like, that's way too much seasoning. Um, but, you know, we like flavor on both sides, so why not? Got a little bit of that. Now, I also like peppercorn uh, pepper, uh, especially the ones that come in a grinder. So it saves you a lot of time. It's great. Kids love it. I love it. Just do a quick couple rounds on each of the chickens here. Kind of cover from one side to the other. I'm sorry for the loudness of this, but whatever. You can bear with me, right? Can I hold it, Daddy? No, just go sit down to your homework, please. Go, Daddy. You can watch, but you can, uh, Marley's holding it, okay? Maybe next video. Okay. I'm going to do a little bit of kosher salt, just to make things kosher. <laughs> I know that was pretty lame. Anyways, a little bit of kosher salt, uh, black pepper, any type of seasoning you got really for chicken that was great. I already preheated the oven for, for uh, 425 here, so we're going to go ahead and pop this in the oven right now. And uh, should be good to go. Uh, just like that, just pop it in. And then um, another side note that you could do, um, I know some of you are probably going to disagree with this, but um, it's quick, especially if you, if you have kids. Um, I like to do instant potatoes. Instant potatoes are a lifesaver because they love mashed potatoes. And it's quick. It takes about maybe at best two minutes to cook. Uh, the instructions are pretty simple. You just get a pot like this. Uh, make sure you boil it to a boil. Once the once the water is like bubbly kind of, I usually turn off the stove and um, pour this in. And then once I pour this in, I start mixing. And then it takes care of itself. The heat takes care of the instant mashed potatoes. I know it doesn't sound great because it's fake. It's not fake, but I don't know. It's good. It says real Idaho potatoes, perfectly blended with real butter. So I guess it's real potatoes. I don't know. 
It says real Idaho potatoes. Um, but yeah, so that's that's something that you can invest in. Um, or you can do a side of rice, which is good. You know, if you got a rice cooker or if you know how to cook rice on the stove. Um, things like that. Um, but uh, I will show you the end results here. Now, let me see this real quick. Yeah. Okay. Um, let's see here.